Hi everybody, so I finally am getting some time to do Emma's three month update vlog. I'm only like two weeks behind, but hey, better late than never, right? So here's the lovely Santa cakes. My big three month old, right? Look at her, she loves to stand up. You're so big, babies. All right, so three months. Um, she is doing so good. She's getting so big and changing all the time and learning all kinds of new things. Um, let's kind of go back, I guess, to how she changed so much over the last month. Um, around nine weeks old is when she started to roll over. The first time that she did it, I think she kind of didn't even realize what she was doing. Um, but she was nine weeks old and we were doing some tummy time and she just rolled herself over. Um, it was really exciting and I wasn't expecting it to happen, but she just did it and it was great. And then it took her a while to, um, do it again. I tried for days to get her to do it again and she kind of just looked at me like, you're crazy mom, what are you doing? And then she kind of got the hang of it. She got really be a lot better at holding herself up and as the month progressed, she was able to hold herself up and, um, just every time I put her down to do tummy time now, she just is just rolling over. So she rolls really good from tummy to back. We're still working with her on, um, from back to tummy, but she's doing really good. Other than that, um, like I said, she is really, really good about holding her necks up. She'll put her arms underneath her and then prop herself up really, really good for a long time. She's always been really strong, um, with holding her head and her head control. But just, I mean, in the past month, she's just totally changed and she's really a pro at it now. So she loves to stand like I just showed you. She loves to bear weight on her legs. Let's see if I can get her to do it. Look at you, big girl. Yay, super Emma. Um, so she loves to be up like that. She isn't so happy anymore when I have her... Um, like laying down against her boppy. She loves to be sitting straight up like this and like look around with you. She's always trying to be like a big girl and um, do what you do and see what you see. So she loves it. She's the happiest when um, she's like that. So that's kind of the biggest change is she just is getting so strong and she's so vocal. She loves to talk. Um, if you've seen a lot of my recent videos, she is just constantly going on and on and just loving listening to herself and um she's all about her hands these days as well she loves to suck her thumb that's something that's new that started last month for her too she um still takes her passy but she loves her thumb she just constantly like the minute her passy's out of her mouth the thumb's in there and um at night she'll usually soothe herself to sleep that way too or during nap time that'll help her so she loves loves it she's all about her thumb and I don't know if it's um partly too because she's really starting to drool a lot and I think she's gonna be an early teether aren't you yeah I think you are because um, she loves to gnaw on her hand and she's always pushing it against the bottom of her um, jaw or not jaw but bottom whatever teeth area <laughs> um so I think that's a huge thing I think she's definitely going to be an early teether but she hasn't been extra fussy um I don't think anything is coming soon but I think she's definitely yeah in the beginning stages of that uh weight wise I don't know what she weighs she hasn't been to the doctor since she was at her two-month checkup and she won't go back till she's four months my best guess is that she's probably um, 11 and a half, probably close to 12 pounds now. She is getting big. She's getting really thick and chub chubs, and I love it. Um, so that's kind of my best guess. She still is in a lot of her um, zero to three month clothes, but she's now starting to fit into her three to six month stuff. So um, she's getting big. It's crazy. Uh, other than that, sleep. She's an awesome, awesome sleeper. Um, she sleeps through the night, and she has for, I don't know, a long time now, it seems. She goes down to bed around 9, 9.30, and she'll sleep until 5 a.m. when I wake her up, when I get up to get ready to go to work. Um, you found mommy's hand, huh? So I don't have any problem with her sleeping. Uh, she still is sleeping in her bassinet in our room. Um, probably next month I'll move her to her crib, and I think it's more a me thing than it is a her thing. Actually, I know it's a me thing. I just feel like <laughs> I've had to give up so much with going back to work and like not getting to be around her and it's like even though she's sleeping next to me and it's just sleep I still like I don't know 
I don't know, it's like a piece of me that I'm not ready to let go of yet. <laughs> as crazy as that sounds, but I think she's starting to outgrow it. I know she's starting to outgrow it. So it's almost time for her crib. Um, so probably in the next couple of weeks we'll be making that transition. She does nap in her crib and she does just fine. So that's good. Um, what else is going on, baby? Oh, she's a great eater. She is still um, both breastfeeding and bottle feeding. But all just breast milk. She doesn't do formula. Um, that's something that I'll talk about. I want to do a separate vlog update to talk about breastfeeding and being a working mom. But... Um, when I'm obviously when I'm not with her, she takes a bottle of breast milk. She eats about five to six ounces each time. So she's getting chubby. She's a big eater. Um, so she does that. She still eats every three hours, and she'll take like I said, five to six ounces. And then um, when I'm home, your hands in my way. When I'm home, she uh, will nurse, and she just does fine. She has no problem switching from breast to bottle or bottle to breast. So. We're still doing good. I I love nursing. I'm like, it's the best. And especially now that I'm not with her all day, every day, it's like such a precious time for me to like get to nurse her at night. So we're doing really good. Um, life's busy and I'm sorry that I haven't gotten this vlog up on time. I, we just have been going through so much changes right now and I'm still trying to figure out this whole working full time and being mommy thing. and. My house is a mess, <laughs> not a total mess, but things just don't get done like they used to get done. So I'm still trying to figure out that whole balance of life, but um, it's going good. Emma's doing really good. So I think that's pretty much it for our three month update, right? You want to say hi to everybody? Say hi everyone. See, my name's Emma and I'm the cutest girl. Say hi, can you smile for everybody? She loves to talk and smile. She's just a happy baby. She hasn't really started to do the big belly laughs yet. She still just does her like hee hees, um, giggles. So I can't wait for her to do a really big belly laugh. I think it's coming soon. Um, she still loves books and um, playtime. She loves her rattles that she can hold um, in her hand. I'll, um, I think you've probably seen it in her video. It's like the smaller one. She loves that one because she can actually really hold on to that and kind of shake it around. And she loves her old ball. And she loves books. And yeah, so she's learning a lot, talking all the time, and she's doing good. So I think that's pretty much it. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. And I think we'll see you next time. Right, babies? You want to say bye-bye? Say bye, everybody. Thanks for watching our vlog. <laughs> All right, bye guys.